If you guys are in need of some coins to get that player or team you've always wanted, make sure to check out Mutt's store and use code TD for 15% off. You know you're desperate when you get excited to pull an 81 Jordan Matthews. That's what makes this series fun. Like, yeah, it is kind of depressing that Jordan Matthews was the best wide receiver on our team. That's kind of the whole point of the series. So I don't know why you guys are hating. And then my boy Riot also said challenge actually pull a quarterback. That'll actually be the challenge for today's video. Has nothing to do with gameplay. If we pull an 85 plus overall quarterback, That'll be challenge completed. We'll get a thousand points for that. Also, rip Blaine Gabbert because he actually got cut in real life. But who knows? The Miami Dolphins don't have a quarterback, so maybe my man will be sticking around somewhere in the NFL. Quick little fun fact about Blaine Gabbert. He actually has 50 career touchdowns and 58 career turnovers. Never would have guessed by the way he plays for our team. Last episode, I want to say it's a record for the most points we've ever earned and rode this Super Bowl, 6,605. That's an absolute crazy amount. So we end up getting three wins. Yes, two of the people quit before the game even started, but it still counts in my book. Now that I think about it, we might have even earned more because Marshawn Lattimore had the interception and then that was actually challenge completed as well. I don't really want to go back and count though. Plus we have 6,600 points exactly. So I feel like that's just a good number. The thing that kind of sucks right now is there's no legend or ultimate legend packs in the store. So I'm thinking we go with this free agency bundle. So that's 2,200 points. We go with the Combine Bundle, which is another 2200 and then we go with the Team Builders. Here we go, pack number one of a decent amount. Can we finally get a quarterback? This is the Team Builder, 82 Elijah McGuire. 90 speed, 90 excel, 91 agility. Honestly, decent backup. We also get another one, 80 Jordan Thomas. Okay, we need no more tight ends. Uh, team of the Week, Rashard Higgins. And uh, we also get Lorenzo Carter. Starting off with a team of the week. We don't say this guy's name around here for various reasons. Uh, here's the team builder, 81 Cody Parkey. He actually just got cut the other day. He's an 81 overall kicker, 84 kick power, 73 accuracy. Bears fans, I am so sorry. This guy might actually be our best kicker. He is our best kicker. We keep getting positions we already have. We need offensive linemen and a quarterback, but for some reason... We just can't get any. I, I don't know what's going on. We get another kicker. This was actually the guy we were starting. It looks like he's already getting his job back. Oh, what is this? Okay, 78 Josh Jones. We need a middle linebacker. And if you guys remember, Josh Jones, 6'2", 90 speed, 90 hit power. The dude is a user god. There is no other way to put it. That's our best pull so far. We also get an elite 80 Meredith. We might actually be able to use him. We get, oh, what is this? 95 Marlon Mack. But the problem is we already have a running back in Walter Payton. Why does EA keep trolling me with these packs? This is by far the worst it's ever been in this series, dude. We keep getting trolled. I don't understand. We have to make a choice because we have Josh Jones already at strong safety. So we can't use this middle linebacker card unless we get rid of this one. Now, the nice thing about this right here, the combine packs, is we get 82 Okafor. You get two toppers, guaranteed 86 to 92. That can definitely help us. 80 Akeem Hicks, another elite. He's got 80 speed. We can't be using him at this point in Mutt. As much as I like Malcolm Jenkins, did we just get another one? 88 Colton Miller. Colton Miller is a huge upgrade, so we are making him a starter. That was quite the pack right there. There was a lot going on. What do we got in number two? Can we top it? Can we get a quarterback? Still haven't got one, so we might fail the challenge. Uh, 87 Perry Nickerson. 97 speed? He's running so fast in that picture, it actually looks like he's starting to turn into the flash. That is crazy. That is quite the pull right there. Final card is a Mutt Hero. 84 will fuller yeah combine packs have been very good for us this is the final one then we got the toppers let's actually go through the back what do we got uh we got a legend 86 ty law okay we're getting a lot of defensive players team builder 86 running back we don't need any more of those i am sick of getting running backs okay topper number one hit me show me what you got we just got josh jones again at least we can sell him for scouts almost 2000 that is a decent amount here is topper number two. Please don't give me another Josh Jones. That's all I'm asking. I I actually, 
Oh my goodness. Also, there is like 30 limited time cards in packs, but you know, I didn't even bother mentioning it because I know we're not gonna get one. When they dropped that 99 OBJ and AB, I spent like $250 on a pack opening and I pulled nothing over 90 overall. I got so mad, I just deleted the video. I like this right here though. Kevin White, 6'3", 93 speed. It sucks he's always hurt because he's got so much talent. Maybe we can utilize him. On to number two, let's go. Jesse Bates. I don't know if you guys remember him. He was so good. Uh, 81 Jordan Matthews. Again, welcome back. We're about to have a ton of scouts. We might just have to save them. Maybe we can get like a team MVP later on. Oh, power up player. I want to say is a combine card. Now, here's the thing. We can't power players up. So I say we make him strong safety if we can't power him up like all the way. And we use that Josh Jones at middle linebacker. I think that's the move. Final card. 81 carry win. We're going to be stuck using Blaine Gabbard again. I can already tell. We get 81 Jordan Matthews again. Like, that is just the story of all these packs. 87 Wilkerson. That's... Oh, flashback card. Uh, Stephon Gilmore. We'll take that. Final pack right here. Can we get a quarterback? That is all I'm asking for. This is the team builder card right here. 89 Latavius Murray. They just had to give me another running back. Okay, so you guys have no idea what I'm talking about right now. So we pulled Neil in one of our pack openings. I don't remember which one. It might have actually been today. So we're able to power him up all the way to 84. Now we can take him to 86. Then to 88. And then to 90. This dude is going to be a beast. We just got ourselves probably the best pull of the series. Now we ran out of training. We don't have enough. We would need uh 4,500 to bring them up to 94 and then another 4,000 to bring them up to 95. We have so many players we have to quick sell. I think we're going to be able to do it. Obviously a big one being Gilmore. Now I love Gilmore. I don't want to do this, but we have better cornerbacks than him. So that's 1,100 training right there. And then the final upgrade, that is 4,000 training. So we have him up all the way to a 95. So we're up to an 85 overall. And after all of those packs, we still have Blaine Gabbert at quarterback, which means I did end up failing the challenge for today's video. Also, our offensive line, that's another like huge weak spot for us. Kevin White, who's going to be now our wide receiver number two, we put Marlon Mack in the slot. This guy's just going to play everywhere for us. So that's pretty much what the offense is looking like. Over on defense, we now have Josh Jones in the middle. Bud Dupree goes back to his normal position. Neil then becomes strong safety, 95 overall. Such an amazing pull for us. Defensive line, we added in uh, Alex Okafor. Uh, so many people use Vic that I wanted his speed over Jarrell Casey. We added Ty Law and Perry Nickerson to our cornerback positions. He's got 97 speed. That is the perfect slot cornerback. I'm starting Bethel still because that dude just makes all the plays for us. And then we still have Iloka uh, at free safety. So, so many upgrades. Still didn't get a quarterback somehow. This is what the special teams is looking like. One more thing. I did sell all those duplicate players we got. So we're up to 12,000 scouts. Now let me know which pack you guys want to see. But I think the move is this one right here. We can do a random Nat team MVP. 97 overall. If you guys want to see that in the next episode, 7,000 likes. I'll get some extra scouts and make it happen. After all of that right there, we are finally playing a game. And of course, if you guys are new around here, you don't know how this series works. Those are the rules up on screen. I really don't feel like explaining it. So just go back and watch like the last episode where I explained everything. There is our top three. We have two running backs. That is definitely interesting. There is his top three. See LT in the backfield. Aaron Rodgers at quarterback. I like it. Props to this guy. Not enough people use Aaron Rodgers. All we see is Michael Vick. It is actually so annoying. The thing is, it seems like I always beat people with Michael Vick. So I should be wanting to play him. But dude, it's just so boring. Like, it's so repetitive. Nah, you ain't going there. Don't even think about it. That is Josh Jones. We were on him like glue. You guys know what time it is. Blaine Gabbert. I had somebody in my comments say, TD, use Walter Payton way too much. It's just so boring. Who else am I supposed to use? When I have a 73 overall gold quarterback that can't throw five yards down the field. And on top of it, I only had one wide receiver coming into this episode. Oh, he's bringing a blitz. We going right at him. Blaine Gabbert, are you kidding me? I don't even know why I'm surprised at this point. We're just taking our points. He kind of gifted us a turnover. So we're going to take what we can get. He's got Franco Harris out there. Oh, he's actually going with the end. Oh, wait. No, he didn't. He did. Uh, 
He did that one play. Marshawn Lattimore, what a play. I know you guys know what I'm talking about. That play used to be so OP. And was it Madden like 16? I'm glad that's not a thing anymore. Nah, you ain't spinning. Josh Jones is right there. The fact a 78 overall middle linebacker just changes our defense is actually crazy. Nah, nah, don't do it. Don't do it. Get there. No way. Incomplete. Josh Jones is all over the field right now. Come on. We got to get another big play. Someone's got to bring pressure. Watch that. Nah, that's short. Okay, I thought Rodgers was going to drag him for a second. What a start. Now we're just going to get some more points on the board. Let's go. Oh, he brought a blitz up the middle. We're going left. Come on. Sweetness. How does he get caught by that big guy? I, I ain't buying it. There's no way. Oh, he's just leaving him open. He's making me throw it to him. Upfield. Let's go. Run him over. Another spin. Oh, if we broke out of that. Third and goal from the 12. We need a dot out of Gabbert. Can we get one? Back at the end zone. Marlon Mack. No way. That's a touchdown. Blaine Gabbert just did that. The gold quarterback, Blaine Gabbert, to the running back, Marlon Mack, for the touchdown. Another thing about that touchdown pass, that was not a high point. That was just his accuracy, you know, being Blaine Gabbert. He's going across the middle. That was almost intercepted. He's going right back to the same exact play. There we go. We got that right there. No, that's not going to work. We're going to bring pressure. He's going deep again. That time it did work. We can bend. We can't break. Got that. No, don't even think about it. Josh Jones again. This dude is way too good. He's literally a cheat code. This guy's starting to bring some pressure with Von Miller off the end. Oh, this time he's using him. Oh, right there. Across the middle. Kevin White. That's a first down. I was going to pass. He's only got three down linemen. There we go. We got some blocks. Oh, that was... A oh, Walter Payton. What a run. We got to try to get something on the sidelines here. Oh, he brought a blitz. Okay. Squares wide open. Get it there. Gabbert. Oh, my goodness. Oh, he's going to use it. Let's go. Right up the middle. Gabbert, get down. We got a timeout in. One second left. That actually put us in field goal range. So, Gabbert, I guess he made up for the bad pass. You guys end up missing it. So, when you've been recording for an hour, your stuff automatically shuts off. Walter Payton just had a huge run. I want the passing touchdown. Give it to me. Right there. Humphreys. We got it. I know that's kind of dumb because we should have tried to get the points with Walter Payton. But something about throwing touchdowns with Blaine Gabbert is just so rewarding. We can't let off the gas, dude. We can't take this guy lightly at all. Oh, we got a sack. Who was that? Another rage quit with Blaine Gabbert at quarterback. I love it. I really don't know how we're doing this. The fact we're able to string together four wins in a row with Blaine Gabbert in that offensive line. I don't know how we're doing it, dude. It just, it doesn't make sense. That is another episode of Road to the Super Bowl in the books. Like I said, smash that like button. We'll open up a team MVP in the next episode. That episode was a ton of fun right there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. I'll catch you next time. Peace out.